and my name is Tatum Ibulan bin Alima Pijan. We are from SK Muka. Today, we will be talking about our project of our vision of a wonderful Malaysia. Let us begin! In our opinion, before anything wonderful can happen in our country, we have to become a wonderful person ourselves. To do that, we have to instill good values in ourselves first. What kind of values you may ask? Well, values such as creative in most things you do, humility in front of challenge, daring to try something new, high sense of responsibility, patriotism for our country. Yes, these values are what make us a better person. And each time, we will strive to make our country a wonderful place for another people. And so, we have met again in representation to our vision of a wonderful Malaysia. This game is called Quackpop. Let us show you how to play this game. Over here, we have our game we call Quackpop. The ping pong ball symbolizes the value that we need to become a better person of our country. <coughs> and the house symbolizes ourselves. We will use the button to control the ground and it turn. Make the balls go into the house. When the balls enter the house, the LED will light up. The game ends when the LED blinks. Don't let the news fool you. This game is harder than you think. I will show you the mechanics of this game we have used. One metal block, one breakboard, one ultrasonic sensor which is connected to pin A4 and A5, four push buttons connected to digital pins 10, 11, 12 and 13, four server motors, connected to PWM pin 3, 5, 6, and 9. 4 LEDs and a bunch of DuPont cables. The push but buttons are what controls the several motors. When the several motors are triggered, the ground of the house will take. After the box goes through the door, the ultrasonic sensor will detect it and the LED will light up accordingly. All of this wiring is hidden under the thick plate of this game. In the coding section of our project, we have used a few codes to control the button servo motor, ultrasonic sensor, and LEDs. When a button is pressed, it triggers a certain servo motor to turn to 90 degrees. Else, when it is not pushed, the servo will turn to 0 degrees. For example, if the push button on pin 13 is pressed, the, then the servo motor on pin will turn to zero degrees. Over here, we have the code for scoring point. It involves the, ultraso the ultrasonic sensor and LED. The ultrasonic sensor will detect if something enters the house and record reading as one. The reading then is written into the score variable. If the score variable is equal to 1, 
then the LED on pin A will light up if the score is equal to 2 then both LED on pin A and pin 7 will light up therefore showing us how many points we have